Blanket Metal Work, August 11, 2021. With all the research, and now I mean, uh, for the strength and toughness and everything else, and I want to test and see, you know, put in some, maybe have a fixed knife, fixed blade knife like this, and uh, would it be usable? Um, especially a very high Rockwell. This is Venatis 4E at 66 Rockwell. And the edge angle, basically more like a pocket knife edge angle, it has 15 degrees per side. Thickness behind the edge is 0.24 millimeter or 94 ten thousand of an inch. So in other words, you know, below uh, ten thousand, ten thousand of an inch. So and the edge sharpened wood, you know, an edge pro, and finished at 200 grit diamond stone. Anyway, and the geometry, this thing is, uh, I think it's well, not that thick, it's less than four millimeter for sure, and the tips, geometry. Anyway, so we'll go, basically go to, I mean, if you would have this as an outdoor knife, and so they would do some outdoor, well, they're not going to be two by four and outdoor, but uh, let's do some two by four first. I'm not going to be careful with it, pretend that's going to be, uh, you know, you said, so I'm, I hold it and handle lightly. Some dry wood. That's why it's not that hard. This wood is harder. It dry. Uh, you can lift this. I mean, it's not really a chopper, but man, you can give for cutting, right? But, is there not big and long enough? Oh yeah, it's what they starting. <laughs> well, <laughs> after that little chop, you see what the... There's stuff on the edge, but you can see. We'll cut the one book paper just fine. And so the edge syntax, as you can see, I mean, the, I expect to survive this thing. Anyway, we'll go to a little harder wood here. This is some rose wood. And you can see it's a little harder. There's a lot of stuff on the edge. There's no slight reflect up the edge right now, so. And this where, this is Argentine Lignum Vitae. This one you really need, uh, yeah, 15 degree per side. You chop full at it, I mean, it's, and it's also when the edge is sharp, that means keen, that means the the apex is really thin at that point, so it could uh, have a little uh, damage. But again, I mean, practically, whether or not you're going to chip or not, thing like that. Right? All right. Well, let's see any 
I don't think that you're going to have the kind of wood in the <laughs> outdoor. But you can see there's nothing. So the edge is totally stable. And let's see. Do a quick uh, tips. I mean, ideally you don't really. Make sure I don't slip and <laughs> cut myself. Hey. Oh, I don't know if it is in the camera. Man, we use it, I mean, if it's safe to survive. So, I don't think that, I mean, most of the time you do knives, you don't want this, this kind of use too much because, so, well, given that it's not survival, but if you can camp or something, are you going to make a... on the knot of this this uh, wood it, it's not a good idea to uh, hit some baton something and this is a very heavy piece of wood actually okay so let's do a quick test Hesitate because stuff in the edge pretty much. And the breeze right now. So nothing. So it's uh, fine. So now this is the part that so you're camping and you have nothing better to do and you happen to eat some uh, you know, beef, beef rib or something and you know, and you say, well, let's compare knife. It might the knife is tough or might that tough and say, well, and here you have sharp edge and this is the bone. Well, we'll see how it does. It's a view. Alright, I'm getting short. I'm not going <laughs> uh, my chopping ability sucks, of precision wise. And, uh, say that, uh, you know, for expect to say, oh, my edge won't have any damage from that. Well, we'll take a close look, okay? But, uh, we, it would take, it took some damage, but at the usability level, I mean, you can say, well, go back to here, see what it looked like. You can say, that. Say, hey, man, what you do? Well, let's take it. All right, let's take a close look. The initial edge here wasn't sharpened that well and here the 200 grit dust shininess and here some of the 600 <laughs> remain here and after the job uh, the bone here you can see 
a lot of deformation right there. These are all bent or dent. So it, you can see every which way here you can see. Thanks for watching.